nine, ten. You're, you're in the seance room. Oh, and um, you're also next to bedroom six. He's gonna die first. Giant spider! I'm scared by a giant spider. Drop one discovery card and you're five spaces. Can you please spaces. give me that? Can you please give me that? Uh, how about you drop yeah. this one? No, don't! I'm dropping it. Um. He doesn't. Yeah, put it in the discard pile. And I uh, now move five spaces. <laughs> okay, cover up the space where you made the discovery. <laughs> okay, your turn, John. That's my nickname. Six, seven, eight. Okay, flip over the tile. John, where are you going? I thought you said you were going to me. Okay, your turn, Aiden. I'm going to the magical teleportation. I'll go here, then I'll go. No, Where are you? No, no, go into that, and then you'll be here, and you can end okay, it. Um, so you gonna make a discovery? Fine. Just go out of here. Are you kidding me? <laughs> and okay, I get right. at least one discovery. In. Okay. Just go right here. You know what? And I, I gotta get a go discovery. back to the base. And then I gotta go. go back to the base. Yeah, you need to get back to the base camp. Your turn, Rory. Wait, is it one courage per, per turn? What? Is it one courage per turn? Uh, one for getting into the base camp, and then two each turn you stay in the base camp. Okay. Five. Ooh, Aiden, down to two. Unless I'm just going back you, to base. Dude, let's, I'll be waiting for you out there after I get a piece. Wait. One, Oh yeah, you have. Liquid courage! <laughs> I use it! You're gonna use it right away? Okay. There's no point in saving it. If you're already hurt. Well, what if you had eight courage? Then you would save it. Or give it to somebody. Okay, don't forget to move up the courage. I need liquid courage. <laughs> yeah, Aiden needs the liquid courage. Okay, Gabriel, your turn. Yeah, like a mint. Eleven, Think one. I should try the room with the giant spider in it again? <laughs> or should we try the other room? Giant spider. Well, um, I think it would be less dangerous. Less dangerous if you just try the room. If you go straight, it will be it won't be dangerous. Yeah, I'll just go straight. Eleven. Yeah. Okay. Well, okay. Here, let's see. Candle. Candle. I'm just nodding. I don't need the ghost detector stuff because I am not encountering very many ghosts at all. Okay, go ahead and cover up cover up the space. Gabriel, here, cover up the space. If I were you, I would rather have that if he doesn't need the ghost detector. Okay, your turn, John. Yeah, I'll give you the sensor array. All right. I don't need, well, but I'm keeping the candle in case I do encounter a ghost. Four. I'm just taking away this <laughs> The giant well, spider? Well, <laughs> then it'll take away two instead. Wait, can you give at least two things? Wait, oh, I thought you did need one of those. I don't need this stuff. Oh, you have the full ghost detector? Yeah. Yeah. See? Well, you, you can give it to somebody when you're in the same room as them or next to them in a hallway or foyer. I'm gonna or you can go back to the base camp and leave it there. You're going to give me that piece, and he's going to give me that piece so I can have the But you guys got to get into the same room in order to do that. I know. That's why he's trying to follow me. Yep. I'm going to go here, go there, and go here, then get in there. I'm just I'm <laughs> okay. waiting for him over there. You're in the... Okay. Cellar. Your no, turn, Aiden. Okay. Oh, that was cool. Are you oh, seven. <laughs> that's a ghost. <laughs> A wraith, you're dead, but you're not out of the game. Yeah, now you get to chase other people. Turn, turn your. Now you're a ghost. Now you chase other people. Yep. Now you can. Aiden. Now you can try and attack the other people. Um, how do you make? So what happens every time you get attacked by, the, by a dead person? If you get attacked by a dead person, you lose two courage points. Uh, and then, <laughs> then the ghost has to move but, back but, to but to one of the three. landing places but on the, the landing. Courage. Yes, you you would lose three because you have the dial. Um, you can move, Aiden. You can move through walls now, and through rooms that haven't been discovered. And if you land on a question mark, you have to move your full amount. But if you land on a question mark, 
you can cover it up so that they can't make discoveries there. If you roll a one, you have to move back to one of these spaces. If you roll a six, you can choose to either move the six or choose a ghost card and sick send the ghost to one of the other players. How would he roll a one? How would he roll a one? Because the ghost only rolls one die. Oh. Because he can move through walls. Yes. So you have a lot of choices. Yeah, okay. So you have a lot of choices now. You're playing against the other players now. You're, okay, so can you're I not. Have the dice? Well, you, it's not your turn now. It's Rory, Rory's turn. But on your, on your next turn, you get to, to try and attack everybody. Right next to the wall. Plus three. Yeah, and nice. Um, what if I roll a two? Then you move two. I'm just going to discover a little bit. Run in fear. You're scared. And run all the way back to base scam. Save it. And can only be used if courage is used at three or less. So if your courage gets down to three or less... You can play that card, and wherever you are on the board, you can go straight back to the base camp this and start very... start gaining courage. Oh, <laughs> um, did you hear me say we're, we're losing some power on the board? That's as loud as it's going to get. Okay. So, uh, but also, I want to tell you that 